All right, Shiba Inu holders, a lot to cover for you in this video. There's been a buy alerts that's been triggered. I want to make you aware of that. Uh, is this the perfect time to buy Shiba Inu? We're going to discuss that. We're also going to talk about the fact that we've got a kind of global uh, stage playing out with Iran, Israel, that you know, war, conflict. What is it going to mean to Shiba Inu uh, as well as to your other crypto holdings? And we're also going to talk real quickly about the U.S. presidential elections uh, and that impact on your Shiba Inu holdings as well as major crypto. So if you haven't done so, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button below. I would greatly appreciate it. By the way, the subscribe button here on YouTube just means you want to follow my content. It's free. If you're on Twitter, give me a follow, hit that follow button. Okay. So right now, as of the recording of this video, SHIB's at 2%. Uh, up, you can see that. And so what I wanted to share with you is there's a top analyst over on TradingView coming out and talking about the fact that we could see Shiba Inu uh, hit a 407 and that we are in, we've entered into a quote, long-term SHIB accumulation zone. That just means that it's your last time to buy Shiba Inu before we start to see it take off dramatically. And so that discussion kind of goes hand in hand with what is going on in the global stage. And we're going to get into that in this video. So the buy alert that I was talking about is over here on the right hand side. You see that green circle. Uh, that's a buy alert coming from my trading indicator software. So if you're interested, links in the description below if you want to pick that up. Now, the last time it issued a buy alert, you can see over here on the left and see this, this blue box. Uh, so from the beginning of that buy alert until the sell alert in 11 days and that see the blue box here says 11 days, two hours, Shiba Inu went up 44%. To give you some perspective, if you had bought $2,000 worth of Shiba Inu on that buy alert and then sold it on that sell alert in 11 days, you would have made just shy of $900 profit. So you would have sold, got your $2,000 back, plus put $900 profit in your pocket. Okay. So links in the description below if you want to try the software. By the way, it's a 30 day, no questions asked, money back refund guarantee right here. So you can try the software really for free. Okay. And there's a discount code in the description when you go check it out that also takes the software down in cost, dramatically discounts it 20, 30 plus percent down to about a dollar a day. The quarterly option is the cheapest and best option. So again, you can give it a try and, you, and you're good to go. Okay. So as I mentioned, this top trader is talking about the fact that we could see Shiba Inu hit 407. Now to give you some perspective, our all time high back uh, three years ago was uh, set at 4088. Okay. So we're down 80% from that. And that was three years ago, actually in on October 27th, 2021, you can see it right there. Okay. So to go back and surpass, uh, to get close and surpass that 407 is pretty interesting. So this top trader over on TradingView, uh, his name is um, Alan Santana, is talking about the fact that we've entered into this accumulation zone and this is the last time to be able to really buy Shiba Inu this cheap. Okay. And so to buy it at approximately where we're at that 4017 range, again, down 80% from that all time high. Now let's talk about kind of what's going on in the global stage and its impact on you and your Shiba Inu holdings. Well, number one, we have the Iran Israel uh, war conflict. And we know that on Tuesday of this, this past week, that Iran launched 200 missiles at Israel. Uh, most of them were shot down via Israel's uh, defense system. Okay, now we're waiting on the retaliatory strike from Israel back to Iran. Okay, now I know we have global diplomacy that's trying to be played out. We got a lot of things going on there. But the problem with that is created a lot of uncertainty in the market. And that's why you see kind of crypto not really doing anything right now because everybody is literally kind of waiting to see how that plays out. So there's that. But also, interestingly enough, that there's historical precedence, okay, for when we have a major military bad event happen on the global stage, that approximately about 60 days after that and after though after that event plays out, we see Bitcoin and crypto dramatically go up. And there's historical precedence, the Russia invasion of the Ukraine. Uh, and a couple others where we've seen like where we've had uh, uh, conflicts where we've had missile strikes on uh, like uh, warships and things of that nature. Right. But so there's so there's this interesting historical precedent there. So it may not be all bad news in relationship to that Iran Israel. Now, again, I'm not dismissing the loss of life and and all of the horrific things are there. But again, my job is to talk to you guys about crypto because that's what this channel is about. OK, so so put, take that and put it aside. Now you've also got 
the U.S. presidential election coming up in, on November 5th. So we're we're literally about one month away from that. Regardless of who wins, President Trump or uh, you know uh, Kamala Harris, there's historical precedent that says that a U.S. presidential election is really, really good for crypto and that we will see crypto go up dramatically from that. So that's an interesting take, regardless of how that of the of the of that that plays out. And that's not just me giving you that opinion there. There's a lot of precedent out there. And I, I covered this in a video earlier today. You can watch it on my channel where I actually talked about this specific thing for about a four minute video. And then lastly, we've got the Bitcoin halving event where we're now in October and we are now in about to enter into the kind of the green box in that in the in, if you will, of where we see potentially Bitcoin and crypto going parabolic. And then lastly, <laughs> fourth quarter of any given year, going back 10, 11, 12 years, October, November, December are, are always fantastic months for crypto. Okay. And so the only real X factor here, the only real problem, the only amount of uncertainty is the Iran Israel conflict. Okay. So we'll see how that plays out. The bottom line, um, you know, we've got a buy alert. We'll see how that plays out. We've got all this kind of going on on the macro stage. So I wanted to give you kind of a walk around the proverbial park so you understood what was going on. Okay. So, uh, yeah, there you go. So there's your latest Shiba Inu news and your latest crypto news for you. So, um, if you're interested, remember, check out my software links in the description below, or if you're watching this on Twitter, it's going to be above me in the, in the description, go hit that 30 day, no questions asked money back guarantee. Go give it a shot. It's a buck a day is what it costs you. Hey, is a dollar a day worth it to you maybe to learn how to trade better, uh, make more money, make more profit in, in crypto and all that. Later. Go make some money. See you.